There's a tree in St Kilda, what we now know is St Kilda, that is probably very old and there's probably a lot of these markers within this landscape, uh, natural resources that are in this place. I live somewhere near that place and it's called the Nargi. It's a tree that has witnessed, well, at least 700 years of movement of waterways and people moving past or moving around, but it gives me some awareness how I still fit into place. That tree would be seen as a tree, but that tree is a significant marker that reminds me and continues to remind me that something bigger than myself went on in this amazing construct of our world. So I have moments of reflecting and then I have moments of reflecting of a, what once was the river that runs through that amazing bay known as Naram. But we need to know what that reveals to us, what materials we require. Then I think about our constellations and think about the old people saying what's in the heavens is reflected on earth. I don't think they would have used the biblical term of heavens, but um, what we say it's Waru Waro, Bunjul, who sits upon high, can look down upon us, but then we can look at those myriads of amazing space out there and start to learn to read the cosmology.